Continue Sports Line Summer Camp with the Brulee Panthers, a program that is in the midst of back-to-back -back seasons without a playoff win. Earlier at 6, Brulee senior Cody Loop said in order for things to trend up, the team has to grow a tougher mindset in the face of adversity. It seems like they're already tough physically. At least junior safety Alvin Watts looked that way in Brulee spring game against Live Oak. There's going to be a lot of rotation in the Panthers' defense this fall. The reason being is they only have three senior starters. The rest are still getting adjusted to varsity football. So a good bit of rising juniors like defensive end Phillip Mason will be counted on. There are a few guys that play both ways like Cody Loop. Loop is a three-year starter who sees time at tight end, running back, and defensive end. In the words of Kevin Gates, he don't get tired. The good about it is you get to impact the game in a lot of ways, you know. Uh, not, not too many people get to do it, but the bad news is it's, it's, it's tiring. But uh, they do, we do a good job of conditioning. Our coaches do a really good job of getting us into shape. I want to have a lot of sex this year, and I just want to get better as a defensive end with my team, and I just want to do better. The defensive side, you have three seniors. Right now you have uh, Romel Williams at a corner, Jordan Woods at safety, and then Brennan Williams on the defensive line. The rest of them will be underclassmen. Uh, now a lot of those guys have played. Some of them have not. And so we'll need them to come together. We'll need them to understand what it is we're trying to do defensively. You are trying to get 11 hats to the football and the kind of effort it takes to do that and the mentality that it takes. But they're buying in. They're doing what we're asking them to do throughout the summer. And uh, we'll keep getting better and we'll keep rotating guys through. Right now, uh, defensively, we're playing about uh, 17, 18, 19 guys. So uh, we'd hope to get to 23, 24. And, and there's some guys that are on the bubble right there that can work their way into it. If you missed any of the team previews from the last two weeks, they are all on WAFB.com and the WAFB YouTube page. Estroma, Episcopal, Port Allen, Parkview, and Dutchtown are also posted on the web. Santa Ma is on the clock for tomorrow. And be sure to check in with us every weekday throughout the summer as we preview 50 teams. It all leads up to the 34th season of Sportsline Friday night on August 25th. That's a look